Welcome to my channel, Planet with Maserati. I am going to be setting up the Erin Condren Notebook, which is the Take Note Productivity Notebook. So before I begin, welcome. Please subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. If you could give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So what I'm going to do is use the Hello Kitty sticky notes and put some notes in here. So I'm not going to like write in it today. I'm just going to put the notes. I'm going to set up the ruler, the sticky notes in here. I have these little dividers that's going to go in here. I have the best way to get things done. It is to begin. And this is where you could write on it and like wipe it off. And then I have my September through November our daily bread, which is the smaller one, devotional, and then December through February. So I want to keep them together. I didn't do September, so I'm going to do September, October, and then when November comes. So I'm going to catch up with October, do September, and then work on November, and then this book will be done, and then December through February. And so it looks like when you get it is a month in the middle of the month. Okay, so I got it in October, right? October 14th. And I still have November. But they sent it to me today, so starting for December. So I'm thinking they give it to you like a month and a half in advance. I'm hoping that's how it works. So then by February, I should have the newer one in January. So then it would be March, April, May. Okay. Well, that's enough of that one. So welcome. Please subscribe. So we're going to set this up. Again, I'm going to use sticky notes to tab everything out. Not tab it, but just like put notes in everywhere I need it. And I should get page flags as well to page flag it. So I use these page flags, which is the post-it. This is my little bag that sits right here. I did bring out my Erin Condren box. This is a mess, but my Erin Condren box. Everything else is clean over here. I just have my pens, my cords, my watch, a phone, um, a mouse, things like that. But you're going to be seeing some more declutter videos coming up in the next couple days. And yeah, let's begin. So, the only thing I didn't show you is my Erin Condren folio. So this is where this will be. Look how pretty it is. Got my name on it. It's just so pretty. The thing with this notebook is it was messed up with the zipper, so I won't be able to zip it, which is fine. And you can see where the board was messed up. There was a few other things like here. So they didn't replace it, but they did give me um, the money back, and they gave me my credit. So they gave me full credit, and but they didn't replace it. So the problem with this is the zipper on the beginning part of it and I told them I had a video I could show it to them it's on my channel plus I can send them the video so you could see it zips all the way through here but when it gets here I don't know if you can see this one here I don't know if I could fix it or not like bend it in or something it doesn't go any further so I could zip it like this far, but the top part won't be able to be zipped. Which is, I think, kind of fine because I will put top tabs and maybe that, you know, will take away the sadness of it not working. So let's go ahead and I'm wondering if I should do the work here first and then put it in. I think so. Let me work on it first. Okay, so what we're going to do is tab it out, like I said, put the ruler and then all this other stuff. So right here, I already have things. This was already put together. I put um, a while back. So let me show you. I'm gonna move all this stuff to the side. So you have where you can write here. I don't really like writing on stuff. This, I think it needs a, a cuter cover and I don't think I have one next to me. Let me see. Oh, I have this cover. It has my name on it. I think this is just busy. Oh, I did put the wrong, wrong 
girls as decoration and I did put the word forgiven. I think this is kind of cute. I think I'm just going to go with this one for now. I do have another one. Oh, I have two of those. No, yeah, I have two of them. And I have this one. Oh, let's take this one with two. Because when you're doing your scripture, you can do that. This one I already tapped, or this was tapped. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to switch my mind. I'm going to use this one because this is already tapped. Whereas this one is not. So let's take this out. See? Got the idea already. I already have a ruler in here. We're going to take it out. Anything else in here, little guys? Anything else? Hopefully I didn't use this one yet. This one I know I didn't. So scratch everything I said about the notebook. We're going to use this notebook. And I brought in some extras. So hopefully this works. Okay. So let's begin with this one. So it says you already have what it takes. Maserati, right? Again, the beautiful back. I don't like the scratches. These are how these come. I don't get it. It does have stickers, which I don't think the other ones do. I think I took them out already. I notice if you do not use the stickers, they get distorted. So this one's already taken out. This one does have it. This one has two pages. So I may take these out. I'm not sure. But they're good for like verses. Um, yeah, this one's out already. Okay, so that one's out. How many do we have here? This one only has one. Well, it's good for one for now. And then I can use it for scriptures and stuff like that. Okay, so this one is a little different. This is take note, subject, do the right thing. I'm going to uh, print my name. Uh, and the computer sticker. Again, you could write on here. So progress is impossible without change. And then you have like a note page here. And then you have like, I guess your little tasks, whatever you want to do. But I'm wondering if it's just notes. Yeah, so it's just notes. Where in this one is why I liked it. Because in here, as I'm thinking about it, it has this section on every single page on this side. So you get the full sheet and then this section like you can write out scriptures, um, the scriptures you want to study, things like that. But I guess this wouldn't be okay because I could still make a line and do that. So I guess we'll do that. Okay. So the first one is going to be... We need a pen, Maserati. We need a pen. Can't start something without a pen. You know, as many pens as I have, I don't want a pen that's going to be distracting. Because I do like this one. We're going to write in it. Okay. So the first one is going to be... I'm going to say Bible study. We'll use this one. I think my daughter bought me this one. She knows I'm addicted to pens. So, Bible study. So we're going to tab that out. What did I do with the tabs? Oh my gosh. I was already losing your mind. Okay, I think I seriously lost tabs. Oh, here it is. Okay. So we have the first one is Bible study. I'm going to tab it so I know what is what. So we'll just go with a blue. Not because of the blue, but because that's the first one here. Okay, so that's going to be Bible study. So we're going to go to the next section, <coughs> which is... What was I going to make it? Okay, so I'm going to have a Bible study. So I'm going to put miscellaneous and then just faith. So if there's anything I found that I like, any like to do verse mapping, stuff like that. So miscellaneous faith. 
these don't stick all the way because it's just this piece. This one says, what you do can improve all your tomorrows. You gotta hope. <laughs> we'll put that one there. The third one is going to be, the third one's, I think, the same amount. I think it's the same amount of paper. Prayers. So this is prayers, um, you know, like when you're doing your uh, prayer Bible. So the prayer Bible... Prayers. What is all over my hand? And it's like ink. Where did it come from? It's like literally all over my hand. It can't be this. So answered prayers, prayers, things like that. A lot of that will be on sticky paper. Sticky notes. It's not on here. Like where did it come from? Like look at this. Oh well. No big deal. We'll use a green one for this one. Oh, no, I already used it. We'll use yellow. And then this is the sticky part. So that's how we're going to do that one. So let's start off with... The first one again is Bible study. So this Bible study could be devotionals. Anything I find that I want to study. Um... Miscellaneous is going to be faith. If I find um, kind of like questions that I need answers, um, what do you call it? Like uh, journaling. So Bible journaling on this one. And it's not going to be all Bible journaling. It's going to be a mis miscellaneous stuff and then prayers. So prayers answered, prayers uh, from the Bible, you know, stuff like that. I want to write out prayers. I have a little task list I could do here. The same with this section as well, and the same with this section as well. Okay, so let's start off with... Oh, my little tab just flew away. Maybe I could hold it with this. Bring you closer, like that. That way it's holding on to something and not falling out. Alright, so the first things we're going to do is put... I'm not going to write anything really in here. I do want to do a habit of something, so that's why I have that one. This is just a ruler. I put sticky notes on here, but I think I'm going to put some more. So I have this one. I think I want a couple of these. Just a few so they're not falling off, but yet I can still use it. I have the second ruler, which we'll be doing the same thing too. And then this one. So for this one, we're going to put it... A Bible study right in here okay and then this half so that's like your first page your forefront why is this stick down better than this one okay but before we put anything else in here what's good is it's the ruler so you can rule out your page like how the other one had the little task thing something like that so in the front of here, again, I'll have my name later. I'm going to put, I think, this one first. Okay. So this one is going to go first. I don't think here. Well, this one looked too bad here, right? We'll put this one here on top. Like so. You need to squish them down. They, they pop right in. Okay, so there's that. In the middle of here, I want to use for something else. So I'm going to take this little Hello Kitties. It comes with three. I got them in that little Hello Kitty box, I think a year or two ago. Comes with a little glue, like the Happy Planner. And every single one, like you're the one mailing it. We can't go to the store and steal it, so... I don't understand why they did that. So this is what it looks like. Trying to get all the glue out. So this one is the back. This is the front, which is super cute. I think I'm going to use... Which one first? Where is it sticky again at? There's another one in front. Is there one in here? 
No, okay. Let me get this one off my hand. I don't want this video to be too long for you. Um, I'm going to do pink. This is going to, like, okay, you're a little hard to put in, but I got it. Okay, so this is going to divide the middle sections. Okay, so again, this is the Hello Kitty bookmarks. So you could put it on the top or you could put it on the bottom. I think I'm going to put some on top and then maybe one on the bottom so it's like mixed. It's like you'll see one here, not in this section, but you know what I'm saying. And again, it comes like that. So we have that put in. We have the sticky notes. We have the ruler. And then we have a divider. The ruler will take you here. The divider will take you here. Okay. We'll see if we put anything else in there. This section, which is going to be miscellaneous, I definitely want a sticky note. This is going to go more towards the bottom. I don't put them exactly on the bottom, but I want it more towards the bottom. So this is the miscellaneous one. This is going to be like first mapping, things like that. Again, we're going, going into like kind of like the middle. Oh no, we need a ruler. Do I want a ruler in this one? Yeah, I want a ruler in this one. So we're going to take the Aaron Contour. I get a lot of these rulers because I order a lot of these notebooks. And where the other rulers are. And this is good too because it takes you to this section if you do it on top or bottom. So I like that. And then let's see. We'll divide it. It's not perfect, but yeah. So something like that. We'll put this one on the bottom. Let's see if I put it here. Yeah. Oh no, it'll be too perfect. Okay, right there. Oh, you can't. Because of this one. Okay. So I guess we'll put it on top. What I could have did was the ruler there, but that's okay. For some reason, this one's not going in. Okay, give me one second to figure this out. They're all the same. I'll have to do it individually, because... Tell me why am I struggling to put this one? Let's get a scissors, because I am really struggling with this one. Okay, there you go. That was a struggle. I'm not going to lie. And then the last one is going to get... Um, I'm thinking this one because I could just write on it. I don't have a ruler. So with this one, I think I'm just going to go crazy with this. Something's wrong here. Something seriously wrong here. Okay, so there's this fourth. Did I skip something? I don't think so, but I don't know why it's not going on correctly. Now maybe. No, see, something's wrong here. This one's like messing up so bad. If you have this, do you, does the studio do this to you? Okay, there you go. That went in perfect. Oh my god, Aaron Condren. This is why I like the Happy Planner. I don't know why these things do this. They're all even. I'll play with it later, but that's where it's going to go. Should I just put this one? Or this one? Like who you're praying for. That's it. We're moving this one. Okay, that's annoying. This one just really just clips in. Sorry for the bouncing. See, it had to be that one. There's only a few that's not popping in correctly. This is why spiral paper get on my nerves. 
Okay, there we go. So that's going to be for the prayers. So the week of, and then who am I praying for? And then I could put notes or whatever. And then in between here, again, we're going to do the same thing. But I'm going to leave less paper because it'll be for answered prayers. Not that it's going to be less answered than it is praying, praying, but answering prayers take time, right? So there you go. So that looks pretty good to me. So next we're going to put, I'm going to see if this will work somewhere else. I think maybe in the front, I have the sticky notes. Maybe here, it's not sticking. I can put like tasks that I need to do and track the habit. If this works better up here, I'm going to scream. No, I'm just kidding. But I have a feeling it works better there. And then the next one is going to be the miscellaneous. And I kind of think we need more than just one section. So we have this section here. And I think I'm going to leave a couple here. Was it this one that gave me the hard time? Let's see. Let's do it backwards. Because it seems to work easier when it's backwards, I think. I could be lying. Yeah, it's just giving me a hard time completely. No, what was wrong with it? <laughs> okay, there you go. So this is as chunky as going to get, right? I'll put stickers and stuff later once I'm ready. Or I might take something out. So we'll see. But for now, I like it. So the first thing we have is the take note. I'll put some stickers on here. My name. This will be for writing. I don't know how comfortable I am with that yet. Sticky notes. You always need some sticky notes. This is going to be the priorities of what I want to get done. Probably for the week or something. And the habit tracker for the month or something like that. And then my Bible study. Again, more sticky notes. Like little tasks that you need to get done. Like four things. You have a little box. You have, you know, dot grid. And you have lined. And then this is all lined paper. So what I'm thinking is taking the ruler. So say I have that ruler from... Or I could use this one because it works. And just mark off a little section. Like this. Every... Probably either every other page. However I work this. And then whatever scriptures are involved or things I want to look up, things like that. So there's that. And then you have another section. So I'm just sectioning them out right now. This is the beginning of it. Then we have miscellaneous faith. And then we have sticky notes to get, you know, that going. And then again, I can just take this, put this like this, and it'll hold it very well. Except for here, for some reason. So this is going to be miscellaneous faith, verse mapping, um, if I want to do a few soap studies, things like that. Uh, so the first one was what, Bible study? Yeah. So then we could, you know, do some other studying. If I need to have journaling, that's what it was, Bible journaling. I could do it in here instead of the Bible. So I have a different section for more stuff. And then a different section for more stuff. And this I could just write out verses that stand out to me or things like that. And then here we have the week of. So who I'm praying for. You got this. Nice little ruler. It does have a top tab so you don't have to worry about it. Again we're going to take this and just bring it up. Until I'm ready to actually tab it out. It actually goes on this side, so it'll help the tabs stay. Okay, well, that was crappy. Okay, let me put it down and then bring this down like that. There you go. Okay. And then it's going to be prayers, and then I have a section. Oh, answered prayers. So the next thing you're going to see, I'm going to stop the video here and come right back. Okay, did you miss me? I wasn't gone. 
I had to just do that. Okay, so the next thing is we're going to go ahead and put this into here. This is going to be a little lengthy video, so I'm apologize. Um, because I'm putting this in here, I won't be able to write on this, but that's okay. I'm okay with that. Let me move this out the way. It's a little struggle to get it in. I just want to make sure it somewhat zippers because the top will not zipper. So if I can get just some type of closure, even like that is perfect for me. So when I'm going places, I have this readily available. Okay, so the only thing I could see would be the problem is this catching every single time I open it. But I think that's okay. This one I want to put in here. But I know if I put both of them, I'm not going to be able to do too much with it. So I like that. And then a few of, I wanted a few of these. Because I use this a lot. So just a few of these to go in there. So if you need to jot down lists, things you want to study, things you want. Should I go in here? Yeah, that's perfect. Just like that. And here, I don't know how well this was. No, I have sticky notes. I don't need that. Okay, so I'm trying to use these up as well. Um, what else do I need in here? What else do I want in here? I don't think this would work. Maybe if I put this one in the front for September, October, November, and then this one in the back. Now, pen-wise, I'm going to have to find two good pens that I want to actually use in here. But I think this is... A little chunky. <laughs> Not a little, a little too much chunky. And it could be the books, but it still closes. As long as I could get to here with it closing, because you could see it might have tabs on top, and this does not close regardless. But I could just fix it so the paper ain't ruined. So give me your thoughts on some of these sections. I want it to be kind of like the war binder, of course, or maybe this in the back here, like that. So it stays secure? Yeah, I think so. I'll have a mild liner and then a pen. So let's grab, no, actually I'm going to do a red pen. And then I'm going to do a quick little, maybe an S gel. Let's see if this one works. Let's write on something really quick. I got this one. And it does work. Some of my pens tend to dry out quickly. And then the S gel right here. Oh, maybe switch. So red for when, you know, Jesus is speaking. And then the Sharpie. S gel. And there you have it. Oh, may not have it. We may not have the pens. <laughs> Is it that one doing it? No, I think it's the this one that's doing it. You might have to find skinny pens. Because I think it'll buckle. We'll leave it like that. I may just leave them in here and not worry about closing it as well as I want to. Let's see. One last close. It's still closing. As long as it's not busting out of the seams, I'm good. You could technically cut this off, but I kind of like having it closed in, but I still like it. So let me know your thoughts. Do I want the ruler in here? Or since I have rulers, do I need a ruler? Because I kind of use that ruler for, yeah, I use this ruler for something else. So let me know your thoughts of it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. It will get filled in, you know. We'll work on it a lot more. Um, do I need these? Because I'm using this. I'm actually not using this. I'm going to put this in here. So just like that. So when I'm tabbing stuff out, it's readily available. I like it. Okay, so the back, I don't think it has a pocket. Right? Yeah. Oh, it does. Oh, 
artsy ideas. So I could put stickers back here when I need them. So there you have it. That is going to be my prayer journal. I don't know if you've seen the Coffee Bible Time and how they have theirs, the thankful. Um, there's quite a bit of sections. You're going to see a lot of things in here. I'm going to start working on it today and then every other day I'll probably like give you a like a view of it so you'll get an idea of what I'm doing. And maybe you'll make your own. And it doesn't have to be an Erin Condren. This is Erin Condren, the folios Erin Condren, if I didn't tell you that. You can see it right here anyway. But um, yeah, so I'll try to give you a video either every other day or maybe three times a week of me working in it. And then we're going to work out like questions, um, Bible journaling, things like that. I do have a book too that I'm going to incorporate with this. Um, I showed you the book. I got it from Happy Lobby. I do want to go there again and get another book. They're closed tomorrow because it's Sunday. I might go Monday. But let me know your thoughts. Oh, I do have this notebook, which is smaller, right? Or no, it's the same size. This is another productivity notebook. I took the stickers out, didn't I? Yes, okay. Just trying to see what I did. And then this one I got because of my mom. She was into sunflowers when I was younger. Bloom where you are planted. And I think that is good for faith. This one I did not put my name on it because it already had a saying. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up. Share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. And I've noticed there's quite a bit of new subscribers. Please stay tuned because there's going to be a lot more faith involved in my videos. And yeah, so I'll talk to you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Don't mind this. This is going to get clean tomorrow. And... I'm thinking of bringing my Bible journaling bag here because I do more Bible journaling now, like Bible stuff, and sliding a lot of this stuff to the side because this is like miscellaneous stuff. I don't need like the pens, the containers, none of that. So I'm thinking that just bringing in my Bible bag here next to this and I could put paper in there. So yeah, stay tuned. We're going to do some more changing on this desk. Have a good one. Thank you, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye-bye.